Hello friends, this is Yrvind and now I'm going to tell you a little bit about why I make a double ender. A boat that is sharp in the back and sharp in the front. And uh, for long, long time, decades of the decades, boats has been, the length of a boat has been penalized. They measure the size of the length and then I say, Oh, we want a bigger boat, so they make it more wide, or so they make it blunt in the front and a transom in the back. But if you have, for example, a piece of clay, like it's this big, and you squeeze it in the front, and you make, it's the same volume, but you get a longer boat. And length is very good for speed. and making less resistance. In fact, if you make for the same volume, if you make the boot longer, it gives less resistance. And this is one of the reasons, but there is another very important reason. And this is when anchoring, and not only anchoring, but like a drogue or a sea anchor and things like this. Boots, they snake, because they got the resistance in the front, I got the most lateral area in the back. But with my boat, I got the centerboard. I can take it away. Then the lateral area moves to the back. And the wind resistance, the mast here and this is in the front. So it lays very nicely into the front. And here I can put out the little rope. So, wow, well, this is the reason. It gives a longer water line and it's better for anchoring and you can anchor up from the back and that's a good thing. Okay, thank you.